There's a few ways you can make an impact in a local child's life this week. Here's Lisa Sugart with the executive director of Big Brothers Big Sisters of Northeastern Pennsylvania, Michelle Hamilton. Michelle, you have a big event coming up this Friday so people can help that way and then they can get involved with the organization. So tell us a little bit about Big Brothers Big Sisters and then how everybody can help. Um, well, we are a uh, mentoring um, program in 11 counties, um, and we are in Luzerne County, and specifically, and NEPA gives this June 4th uh, is for Luzerne County and many other counties in the, in the state, uh, but we are uh, accepting donations that runs June 4th, you know, 12 a.m. to midnight, um, and we look towards um, our donors and individual donors um, and sponsors that day to help support um, the, the mentoring um, operations of what we do behind the scenes, matching um, youth ages 7 to 14 with a positive uh, adult role model. Um, and so hopefully um, we can reach our goal, $5,000, and we have a wonderful sponsor, um, the Hot Family Foundation, who is matching us this year. Um, so we're really honored to be um, part of the Hot Family Foundation this year. You really took a hit this year because of the pandemic, because one of your, your biggest fundraiser had to be canceled because of COVID. So this is our second year that our, our, our biggest fundraiser had to be canceled. Um, Big Bowl for Kids Sake was our largest fundraiser through many of our counties. We canceled them uh, March of 2020 and, and this past year. So Quiz for Kids Sake was in its place and it was a lot of fun this year. So um, we're going to be looking to do that again, probably in the fall or the winter again, and, and hopefully have that in its place if we can't get back to bowling. And um, NEPA Gives is around the corner. So hopefully, um, you know, if you're out there listening, please help support us in our matching of our littles. Also, though, when there are children in the program, you need big brothers and big sisters. So how great is that need right now? It, it, it's quite a big need. Um, we have about 100 children on the wait list right now. So we need volunteers. Um, we, it's been difficult because of the pandemic not to be able to go out and um, do outreach in person. Um, so we've been doing a lot of info sessions via Zoom. Um, I think a lot of people are doing that right now, so we're no, no different. Um, and we actually have a few coming up. Um, so I'll share that with you. We have, um, they're all online, so you just have to, to um, contact us um, and, and let us know if you'd like to be involved. But it's just a, a brief half hour during your lunch. Um, we have one on June 7th at noon. And we have one at June on June 28th. And then also at 5.30 at night, we have one on June 21st. And this is for volunteers to learn more about the program, the process of becoming a volunteer in a big, and what it really means um, to, you know, to, to be virtual or a community mentor. We do have that option. If people are not feeling comfortable yet getting out, I know we're getting to that point where people are, are vaccinated, but we do allow that virtual option um, right now. So just give us a call um, if interested, um, you know, at 570-824-8756 and somebody can send you the Zoom link um, to, to join. Someone watching this might say, are there certain qualifications for me to be a big brother or a big sister? And are there? We do look for um, anyone that's 16 junior and senior in high school and up. Um, and we also have a recommendation that we would like to see at least a one year commitment um, I think that's really important for our littles to have that consistency throughout the year um, in that, you know, really the other expectations are just to spend one hour to three hours per week. Um, and it doesn't mean that you have to be, um, you know, a rocket scientist or anything. I um, mean, just spending time with a, with a, with a child, with a child, you know, and listening, um, playing games, doing something that the little likes to do or teaching something that you're really good at. Um, and sharing, sharing a skill. We do background checks, um, we do references, um, and then we also have interviews. So that's part of the process is to really kind of find out from the big what their expectations are um, and from the families of the littles, kind of what the goals are of the little. Today's news feature is brought to you by Frankie's Pizzeria and Restaurant in downtown Hazleton. For more information on their specials, hours, and where you can find their delicious tavern pizza, you can call 570-454-6000 or you can visit their Facebook page.